You are now watching a Lucky Penny Shop product feature. Hey, it's Lucky Penny Shop. Thanks for stopping by today. I need to do another handheld game. I'm trying to get through this whole collection. Um, this way I have probably the world's largest collection of handheld games on video. Not that I'm trying to achieve anything in particular, just trying to capture them for history so that we all know. 30 years from now, what is this? It is Trivial Pursuit. What kind of game was that? Well, you know, maybe in 30 years these videos will have more meaning to more people. I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to just turn the bin around from the last time. I'm going to reach in down here and see, you know, Wheel of Fortune. And we have Pocket Poker. Now, I've been doing a lot of poker games, but uh, I might as well do it now. I pulled it out of the bin. Let's check it out. All right, so Pocket Poker Royal Flush 3000. You get a straight, three of a kind, two pair, jacks are better, straight flush, four of a kind, full house flush. Now I did a, and it's a Radica, I did a, another poker game and you were only allowed to, well, you couldn't replace the whole hand. You had to um, at least take two cards out of your hand so that you can draw three. So this is model 1310, I believe. I've got to get my little tool. It's really hard with the black on black to see it. Let me get the light on, yes. 1310 Radica Limited HK Made in China. And it tells you to try new batteries if it doesn't work. So let's see what we got. Okay, so triple A's. Two triple A's, which I happen to have here. I've been keeping batteries on the side. Here we go. Ooh, I love that sound. Do, 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 do. Deal draw. Game over. Music, points. Hold, 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 hold. Okay, on. It's just saying, it's just flashing game over. Is there a reset? Okay, let's try that again. Let's take a battery out just to kind of let it think. It needs to think. They make it so difficult to get a battery out. Okay, there, it's reset. Let me hit deal drop. Hmm. Let me hold down the deal draw button. So it's just stuck. It's stuck and game over. That's too bad. Whoa, do you think it could be the batteries? Like uh, maybe they're just a little too weak? Let me grab one more from my battery bin and see. I know I've been having fresh batteries here. Let me put in one more battery. <laughs> <laughs> Game over. Yeah, that says on, and it's not letting me do it. Let me just hold some buttons down to see if it bumps out of this. Okay, it's not. That's too bad. So this time, I'm going to hold this down while I'm putting the battery in. No. I wouldn't even know how to correct that. I've never actually taken one of these apart. That's weird that it's just locked in this mode. Ooh. What happened? I don't know. Hold. Hold or draw? Hold, hold. So it's acting real funny. I'm pressing really hard. Let's see. Will it draw? Points. Music is gone. Let me set it down. Hold. Hold. What's going on? Oh, the batteries are out. It's still lit up. Okay, we had something there. 
it almost seems like the keys really need to be pressed hard. So it's something with the buttons on the inside that's causing the issue. All right, here we go. Pressing really hard. Okay. So let's hold. Hold. And hold. Pressing. Oh, so I can hold two. Get my two fingers in there. It only lets me hold two. Game over. Okay, deal draw. Hold. Wow, pressing so hard. So it won't let me hold it. Okay, held. Let me pick it up and do it. Okay, so it's definitely something with the keypad. I've got three held. Deal draw. Okay, it works, but they're really hard to press. Do you think this will take the whole thing apart, just these two screws? I feel like, nah, there's got to be more to it than this. It's got a, some kind of clip to take it apart. Let's make sure there isn't a screw in here. Let's zoom this out too. Okay, so that did something. I mean, it wants to come apart. Okay. Oh, that slides down. Ooh, we're in. Oh boy, we're in, but look at all those screws. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight screws to hold this board down. That's excessive. Well, you know, it's a it's it's a learning process here. Whoa. It's the same screws as the other screws, it looks like. Oh, they're maybe a little bit different. So these two look the same. These two look a little longer. So, the ones that hold this in place, why would they use eight screws? I wonder if we put something where the keys are that it has more pr less pressure, I mean more pressure on them so that it's easier to press. Or if it's all electronic, why are they not sensing or reading correctly? All right. I think we're gonna have to go this way. And we'll see what's under here. Okay, so they're all attached to the board. They should come off. They look dirty to me. So let me take a pencil like I've done in the past and see if we can just clean them up just a little. on my shirt yeah so this one's really dirty
Well, this is how I've cleaned these in the past. Now, if someone's got a better way or there's a chemical that you would use on these, I've never actually done that. They're definitely shinier now. Okay. Let's just put this in here. And then let's just flip this back over. Carefully. Oh, the screen comes off. Let's see if the screen's in the right spot. Screen's in the right spot. Let us get those eight screws back in. We'll see if it did anything. If not, we'll just play it with the pressure. Here, we don't want to see the tops of my hands, do we? Oh, my hands are drier than normal this time of year. Now that screen popping out, I wasn't expecting that. Now that that's somewhat put in, let me just do a quick check. Here, I could do this. Oh, it doesn't want to stay in without the thing holding it, so let's do that. All right. It wants its screws back in. Let's just do it. We heard sound. I just wanted to make sure that the screen lit up. So I'm going to test it one more time before I go any further. See if I can hold the batteries and keep that screen in place. I mean, see if the screen lights up. That was the one thing I was not expecting to happen. Okay, so it needed that. It needs that uh, connection there. I'll come back. We'll have to just reopen this. All right, we're struggling now. Let's just put the screws in. I just don't want to have to take it apart again to see if that screen's in the right spot and why it flipped out like that. That's okay. We've gotten this far, I could put it all back together and then take it apart, no big deal. I just won't do it on camera, I think I've taken enough of your time. I just find this stuff interesting, looking at the old electronics. So something with this connection here to that It needs to be touching. And then this wire probably, well, we'll just leave it where it is. And this slid up like this. Okay, let's turn this back up. Just a terrible angle. Deal draw. Oh, did you see that? Okay, hold, hold. Okay, so that fixed it. So now the holes, everything works better. Just by cleaning those contacts. Okay, we're good. I won. 
I'm a winner. A pair of aces. <laughs> so this one doesn't allow you to bet like that other one. So everybody's got this. Now you see how to fix it. I have had people say they they love these poker games. I mean, they are very popular games for handhelds. All right, so deal draw. Deal. Did I turn the sound off accidentally? I think I did. Win. How come I got no sound now? What happened? It's working a second go. Hold, hold, hold. Win. Then maybe I didn't clean that one enough. Put it down. Probably it. Hold, hold, deal. Yeah, I lost my sound. Well, I will take it apart and double check that, but I won't do that on camera. Wow, it's working so much better, and then that happens. Five, five. Game over. Deal draw. Queen, seven, seven. Deal draw. Ooh, three queens. All right, I'm gonna check this contact here. Maybe it didn't get clean enough? I don't know. All right, I'll be back. Let me do this off camera. Now I know what to do. It shouldn't take long. I will be back. All right, so I did not have to take it all apart. It was this that was dirty. I cleaned this up a little bit. And then I put the batteries in, and voila, it worked right away. But let's see. Maybe things are fidgety. You can't help fidgety things. Ooh, we're popping out batteries. Let's see. Okay, it must be just fidgety. It was working great just a second ago. Let me just try it again. Let's see. It's intermittent, so something is going on with that that speaker area. Okay, so let's see. Maybe this wire is getting in the way of it. Maybe it's, it's that simple. Let's see. Oh, let's put the batteries in correct. Okay, so I think that's it. I think I just hit it with the wire. So now let me be a little more careful. It's really annoying when those batteries pop up. You think that's it? Oh, man, that's annoying. I'll hold off on those two screws. Okay, do we have it here? Man, that was a challenge. Okay, so I can turn it on and off now. Okay, so I think that was it. A win. Three kings. <laughs> I just love that sound. Okay, generally speaking, um, we got it. 
I'm learning. Never taken one apart before. Had the batteries in wrong. They popped out again. <laughs> they shouldn't just be popping out like that. Get in there. Okay, everything out of the way. Here we go. Here we go. Let's play some serious poker here. Let's hold, hold, hold. That is not serious. A648 queen. Hold, hold. Win. Okay, let's not hold any. Let's say that's my hand. Let's see if it lets me lets me do all five on this one. And I won. Let's see if we can hold them all. Game over. Okay. We got it. We got it. We feel good when we get it. We don't feel good when we don't. But it's worth trying, isn't it? And I'll do a few more. I think the video will turn out to be much more involved than I had intended. And then took a little time. All right, one more big hand. Big hand. Ooh. Mm-hmm. King 10. King 10. Oh, pair of jacks. We still won. All right, there you go. I did it. It is the pocket poker from Radica Royal Flush 3000. I fixed it, showed you how to fix it. It's working fine. Except for all the battery poppings, I think we're in good shape. And thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. On to the next one, and hopefully you're uh, enjoying these different handhelds. Let me know in the comments. I really need to know. I think I'm 10, 12 videos in already. Uh, and, uh, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, and none of them have been released up till this point, so... Thanks for watching. Later. If you're looking for the item you just saw in the video, click here. Watch more videos by clicking here. Don't forget to share on social media and give a thumbs up. Hey, LPS Dave. What's up, Butch? Make sure they don't forget to subscribe. Oh, yeah. Please click here to subscribe to Lucky Penny Shop. And always remember when you see a lucky penny, pick it up.